South Dakota technical schools will soon graduate from the word institute and become South Dakota technical colleges. Kelloland's Brady Mallory joins us now with a closer look at why this name change is significant. Brady? Yeah, it's a big deal. Executive Director of the Board of Technical Education, Nick Wendell, says the word college is important to its overall mission. Well, he says this will help South Dakota better align with the technical colleges in the rest of the nation. It's not just homework. Angie Lucid is designing her future. I wanted to become more creative, but also actually work more with market, marketing and advertising. The media design major says she found the right education and hands-on work here at Southeast Technical Institute, which will eventually be known as Southeast Technical College. I think it's great that they're changing the name. Um, I think we're just the same as every other normal college in the state. But what's in a name? Well, to answer Shakespeare's question, or yours for that matter, Nick Wendell says rebranding as a college could help tech schools recruit and retain students. Students and families want to uh, go to college, uh, and so I think the way we refer to ourselves matters. Wendell says dropping institute in favor of college has been a years-long goal. One of our central missions has been to advance the public perception of the value of technical education in South Dakota. That value translates into preparing students like Lucid to become skilled professionals who will fill gaps in South Dakota's workforce. We need to do everything we can to encourage more folks in South Dakota to consider technical education and consider a pathway that will bring them into high demand and jobs in our state. As for Lucid, she graduates this spring. She knows her future all starts with the important work she's doing now. I'm going to be ready. I'm definitely ready to get into the workforce. Uh, Brady, when will we see these names change? Uh, it turns out it's already been happening. Wendell says that work has already begun, with all of them slowly phasing out the word institute. The legislative bill becomes law in July. Wendell says after that, you can expect to see more of a rollout of new signs and logos. Interesting. Thank you. Yeah.